may also know me as Geller Life. Today I'm making a video of us raptor lining the tub of my 2015 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited. Nick and I have spent the last month or so building a full custom roll cage for my Jeep here. And so we already have the carpet, the interior and everything ripped out and I did not want to put that carpet back in. It's so gross from dog hair and mud and dirt that I wanted to go with this. We did use raptor liner in our TJ, I think it was about five years ago, we sprayed the tub and bat and it's held up wonderfully. So that is why I wanted to buy a raptor liner again. And uh, so I'm gonna show you the process. Don't mind the sound of the heater. As you can tell by my breath here, it's very cold in here. So I gotta get it warmed up before we can spray today. Now, I know I didn't show the process of us taking my center console out. Um, that's because we've had it in and out a bunch of times throughout the process of building my cage. However, when you take your center console out, you think it's not gonna come out and that the plastic isn't gonna fit around the parking brake. Bend it way more than you think, and that's how you get it out. Side note, I remembered when we did our TJ however many years ago, the overspray was absolutely awful and we were finding black speckles on everything around the Jeep after we had sprayed. So we put up this lovely plastic lining to protect the rest of our barn when we spray today. Okay, so we just got it sprayed while well, Nick did. He doesn't let me spray paint because I'm not so good at it. But uh, it's supposed to be touch dry within one hour, but it takes, I think, five to seven days to fully dry. So we'll probably put it together before that though. Just an update here. My Jeep is now up in the garage. Today is Wednesday and we sprayed the bed liner on Saturday. It is totally dry to the touch. However, it still smells strongly of paint in my garage now. So we are gonna let it continue drying probably until this weekend, just because I'm working from home. So I don't really have anywhere to go anyways. So might as well let it fully cure before we put everything back together. And that is a wrap. We got the rest of my Jeep put back together and the Raptor liner is looking just as good as I'd hoped. If you're interested in seeing more about my Jeep or our other five Jeeps for that matter, you can follow me on Instagram at Yeller Life and at Yeller Fab. Thank you guys so much for watching.